Hello my family members, welcome again to Techno UF channel. I hope all of you are preparing well for your upcoming on-campus drive. Today I brought a coding question that was asked on Accenture on-campus drive 22nd August 2023. Let me tell you that the second code will be published today at the evening. So subscribe this channel to get all the real questions asked in Accenture on-campus drive. So let's go. So the question is so the question is regarding favorite number of Rohan. Rohan enjoys mathematics and has a few favorite numbers. Therefore, Rohan prefers positive integers whose sole lucky digits in the decimal notation are 4 and 7. For instance, lucky numbers are 47, 7, 4, 4, 4, etc. Whereas unlucky numbers are 5, 17, 4, 6, 7. If a number can be divided evenly by a lucky number, Rohan considers it to be a almost lucky number. He needs our assistance to determine whether the supplied number n is nearly lucky or not. Actually, this is the proof that was asked on 22nd August of 2023, right? Okay, let's go to solve the problem. At first, let me write the code. Then I will discuss whatever I have written in the code, right? And I will discuss whatever the syntaxes used, what are their functions, right? Okay. Let's take lucky numbers. Sorry, or lucky digits is equal to 4 and 7 according to the question, right? and then take a function inside this function each lucky digit each lucky digit uh, the digit as an argument and return uh, the digit right in is lucky digit in lucky digits right sorry lucky digits and then take another function each lucky number sorry is lucky number it is also taking a number as an argument and it is also returning all inside each lucky digit digit for digit in str now right okay now let's run a for loop for i in range sorry i in range one to number plus one that is one to n inclusive right and let's check if number is evenly divisible by i or not and another condition is is lucky number the number is lucky or not right both conditions should be matched right to be a nearly lucky number right so if so then return true otherwise return false right okay now let's uh, write the driver code right at first let's take the input int input right and check if the number is almost lucky or not if so then print almost or if not else else print that not almost right 
so i hope this code is okay let's run the code first then check if this is okay or not right okay run so the input was 47 not almost but why actually the fault is here right actually we should return the false outside of the for loop right okay let's run the code then i hope this is okay right so 47 is almost lucky number and 744 is also almost lucky number and 4 is also lucky number and 5 it is not right and this is not lucky number right and 17 is this it, it, this is also not a lucky number and 467 it, this is also not almost lucky number right so whatever i have written i have i am i'm explaining that that is this is the lucky digits that is 4 and 7 that we have initialized right and this uh, is lucky digit this is helper function that takes a digit as input and checks if it is a lucky digit among 4 or 7 or not right it returns true or false if so right and is lucky number is also another helper function that takes a number as input and checks if all its digit are lucky digits and uh, it converts the number to a string and checks each digit using the is lucky digit function it returns true if all the digits are lucky otherwise false right and let's uh, actually the main part is here right uh, it is actually going to one going from one to the last digit right and it is checking if the number is divisible by the current value of i and the i is this the lucky number if so then it returns true that means it returns the um, actually the it is giving signal that it is the almost lucky number right and here the driver code i hope you have got the logic right so to get more such content i mean to get more such coding questions or any aptitude questions of accenture on campus drive then please subscribe this channel and watch the playlist regarding accenture on campus preparation right so thank you for today's session